Australian reclusive researcher Ronald Pegg claimed that ancient texts contain descriptions of time travel encounters. Hello, my name is Eddie Pengilly and I have investigated these claims. My paper is called Time Travel Evidence Found. It examines three of Pegg's claims. Some stories of gods and angels were about time travel encounters. Certain ancient texts describe and depict computer technology. A data disk of that technology has been identified. Ronald Pegg says that many ancient texts have been mistranslated into English, therefore we need to check for their original meaning. For Egyptian glyphs, we utilise an Egyptian grammar book. For the works of Nostradamus, we use a French dictionary. The Bible and Book of Mormon, we use the Hebrew and Greek lexicons in Strong's Concordance and an English dictionary. Let's check three of Pegg's examples. Egyptian glyphs. The papyrus of Ani was transcribed, then later translated into English. But when the original papyrus is compared, starting in column 1, plate 1, it immediately becomes clear that some glyphs have not been copied correctly. Six of the twelve red glyphs are wrong, which means the English translation is of substituted glyphs. Nostradamus, Quatrain 1, Century 1, Line 2. We are told it means it is placed on the brass tripod. But checking a French dictionary gives, by itself, rests on the saddle in the air. I found that this and the Egyptian papyrus were describing the same piece of computer apparatus. These three glyphs mean to shine. The red glyphs mean a disc, its flat underside shines. A disc, its protruding ledge, is a disc shaped saddle in the side of the box. by itself rests on the saddle in the air. I explain these two findings in part two of my paper. Searching ancient texts for evidence for computer technology revealed that this mid-1800s picture from America shows nine witnesses holding a plastic CD jewel case. Plastic had not yet been invented at that time. Ronald Pegg examined stories from the Bible and gave many reasons why accounts of human time travellers and their equipment have been hidden within its words. The Bible was originally written in different languages. It was written without chapters and verses. Word order in sentences has been rearranged. Words have been added. Words have been left out or ignored. In many cases, the original Hebrew and Greek word meanings have not been used. When I personally check the words in the Bible to an interlinear Bible for word order and Strong's Concordance for original meaning, those resources validated Pegg's claim. My paper examines extracts from four biblical texts. My paper is called Time Travel Evidence Found and it generated comprehensive supportive evidence to demonstrate that time travel back to the past has taken place by human time travellers, computer technology was seen and documented by particular ancient people, including the four mentioned biblical writers, who documented their encounters with a time traveller and his computer equipment. You can download the paper from timetravelevidence.com.au